So the problem that we're going to do is ethyl, ethyl alcohol is prepared industrial by the reaction of ethylene C2H4 with water, H2O. Uh, what is the percent yield of the reaction if 4.6 grams of ethylene gives 4.7 grams of ethyl alcohol blushing? Um, so let's go ahead and do this. So it gives you the reaction equation. This is C2H4. Um, so it also gives us uh, the mass of ethylene, so the mass of C2H4 equals 4.6 grams, and it also gives us the mass of ethyl alcohol. as 4.7 grams. Okay? So, what's the percent yield? Do we just say 4.6 divided by 4.7 and knock it out? No. no. We've got to do what? Convert to moles. Convert it to moles. Okay, we've got to convert it to moles. Um, in this reaction, hopefully you guys are asking, well, how do I know which one's the limiting reagent? Okay. Hopefully that was the question you're asking yourself because they don't give you the mass of water, right? Remember what we said, well if they don't give, first of all, if they don't give you the mass then they must be saying the other things, the limiting reagent, okay? So in this case ethylene is, but not to mention the fact that water is very inexpensive. Remember what we were talking about limiting reagents? Limiting reagents are usually the more expensive or the less prominent or predominant thing. So. Ethylene, of course, is going to be the limiting range. If they don't, uh, obviously I don't expect you guys to always get that, you know, but if they don't give it to you, then you just to assume that that one is the limiting range. Okay, so let's go ahead and figure this out. So we've got to figure out, well, what's the molar mass of both of these things? Okay, so. Um, ethylene is going to be 2 times 12.01 plus 4 times uh, So, molar mass of ethylene is 28.052 grams per one mole. And this is C2H4. So that's going to give us the number of moles of ethylene. with the 
product. Okay, we figured out what the percent yield is. Is everybody okay with that? So, figure out percent yield. It's going to be the number of moles of limiting reagent divided by the number of moles of product divided by the number of moles of limiting reagent. So, So do we have all those numbers? Yeah, so 1.02 moles divided by 0 0.02 moles of moles times 100%. Notice moles cancel. What did you guys get? 62.2%. 62.2%. 2%, but when we come back over here, uh, it's 2 sig figs, so um, let's just take it to 2 sig figs, so it's going to be 62%, we'll say, 62% yield. Okay. Is everybody okay with that one? You good with that one? Okay. Good. Question? What makes... Uh, 4.64 mole uh, C2H for limiting reagent. Pardon? Why was the top one the limiting reagent? It runs out first. Because it, the, this is the reagent in excess. We will. Yeah. So, I mean, they don't give you any information about it. So, I mean, this, what are you saying? Why isn't this it? Yeah. This is the product. This okay. is not something that you're, this is not a, a reactant. Is the problem saying that? Um, I don't think you're understanding this. So the thing is, is the limiting reagent is going to be one of the reactants here. You know, this is the product. Okay. So you can only, it's like the race. Remember we were talking about the race? So the limiting reagent of a race would be how many people started it. Okay. So, and we're talking about starters Right? It could be only this thing or this thing. Right? This is like how many finished it. Okay? So if we had 164 that started it and 102 that finished it, that's what we're getting our percent from. Okay. Does that make more sense? Yeah. Okay, cool. Just think about it like a race. Okay? Yeah. So if you had like multiple reactants, so you have to actually you have to figure out what the limiting reagent is, right? If, so if, it, if in this case it said the mass of water is, I don't know, 18.02 grams, right? Then you'd have to use that to see if that's the limiting reagent. Like, would it be the one with the least amount of moles? The least amount of moles. So in this case, this. Other questions about that. So remember, you've got to do the limiting reagent first if they're both given to you. 